Hi traders, this is Cynthia of Day Trade Forex bringing you a training video for my new Easy Color Trend and Flat Advanced System. And we're looking at a high contrast template where the boxes are a light pink and a light blue. And we're also looking at a pound gin five minute chart. And this is a scalping trade that we found earlier in the day where the price had reached the top of the colored box so we were looking for down sales at that point and this was one perfect entry this was our first perfect entry for 40 pips this is our second perfect entry if you see that everything is aligned everything's color coordinated and in this bottom box the signal MACD signal line had crossed down below the zero line so that's your perfect sell entry here's your third sell entry you had a total of 40 25 and 60 pips and if you had practiced a very profitable money management technique a lot size technique you could have actually taken half of your lot size here booked it as profit and left the other half of the trade open and run and then when you had a new sell entry enter with the new full trade lot size that you're used to using and here take half of that trade you still have this half open and running now you're going to have a second trade the second half of the trade open and running and then make a third entry here and then down here after three sell entries I would not attempt a fourth one I would find a bottom here which you can see when all of the colors change color and also the MACD down here the signal line is crossed above the zero line so that's your indication that the trend has gone flat and it's confirmed by the gray flat bars here in the trend, trend window and of course the RSI has turned aqua and gone up so you know you've hit bottom here and after three cell entries that are successful just exit all of your positions at the same time and this is a way to compound your pips which is actually broken down into three swing trades within the major downtrend so it's a money management technique a lot size technique that uh, can gain you a lot more pips on one single move and then we go into a flat consolidation area if I move the chart forward we've actually come to the end of the trading day and this dash separator line the 5 p.m. Eastern end of the day session and the beginning of the new trading day and we did have a large red arrow however the boxes turned blue so we can expect this time of the day to see some fluctuation in price and color and the main thing is that trades that you were in before you must absolutely close them before 5 p.m. Eastern because the spreads get very very wide we're trading the pound gin which is my favorite scalping pair because normally the spread is very small compared to the the main major trends that it can actually make the moves can be very big it spends less time than almost any other pair in a range condition so flat areas are usually short and the trending can be very long and very strong so this is really my favorite scalping pair out of all of the other pairs I really concentrate on this pair when I feel like I want to do scalping and even if you switch to a higher time frame let's go up to say a well let's just go to a 15 minute chart and this is a long uptrend but you're in a pink box so you would not have taken that trade unless you're an experienced trader and you feel comfortable counter trend trading if you know how to counter trend trade you actually had perfect buy entries and this was a nice long trade but you're trading against the pink box so if you're an experienced scalper you know that you have to stay in front of your PC and for sure use the Cynthia's trailing EA trade manager now here it reached the high of the day right around in here and you did receive your first sell entry here this was a little premature 
before the big red arrow but if you had waited in the 15 minute chart for the big red arrow you would not have given up too many pips if you had waited for this uh, confirmation because this first one you had a gray flat trend bar and so the next bar it turned red so this was really a safer entry and, and in the 15 minute chart you can't really see the pullbacks very well here you can because you had one green candle so if you're interested in trading multiple entries within a, a swing trade it's probably better to do it in a five minute chart because you can have multiple entries that are clearer to see and of course down here in a 15 minute chart this is where you would have exited all positions if we go to the 30 minute chart you can see that where we identified the high of the day really was the high of the day and again down here before the close you would have exited all positions so even looking at a 30 minute chart you can use that to identify a major trend and stay within the trend and use the five minute trade for quick scalping trades going with the major trend so let's look at the one hour chart and we've been on an uptrend for this is three days and today the price decided to reverse so there's a lot of profit taking if we look at the four hour chart for three days and now this is the first day of a downtrend so the boxes at 5 p.m. Eastern has turned blue but right now that doesn't really mean anything that can change also you can uh, well this charts a little busy in the four hour I have to expand it we can see a little bit better now the Fibonacci retracements however the retracements are upside down because we've been in an uptrend and now today we've been in a downtrend so the Fibonacci retracement has actually in a four hour chart the price dropped down to almost the 61.8 Fibonacci retracement actually it just changed here so it's sitting on the 50 percent Fibonacci retracement level so that's a very strong downtrend so if it decides to keep going back up it's going to be very strong push to the upside so this is how you can trade the five minute chart and how you can look at the higher time frames and analyze here it's a premature buy the SAR dots are pink on top this is okay this is okay but the MACD signal line has to cross the zero line first when all of these happen which could happen then yes you can trade in a five minute chart going long because actually today was a retracement from the three day previous uptrend so it's possible this will find bottom this is all possibly the bottom for the day and we could be going up again in the next several hours actually the Asian session is a really good time to be trading the pound yen I also like to trade the pound New Zealand dollar in the Asian session so if this is the only time of the day or if the Asian session is the only trading session that's comfortable for you to trade those are the two pairs I would recommend trading you can also trade the, the pound Aussie which I like and moves very well so those three pairs the pound yen the pound New Zealand and the pound Aussie are all perfect for trading in the Asian session so thanks very much for watching and good luck in your trading see you in the next training video